controller. I love video games, Xbox, PlayStation, Nintendo, and Sega Boy. Really don't matter to me, man. Who ready to play? Hold up, the game here got something to say. Hey, what's up everybody? It's your boy God Shepherd, and I'm back. Oh yeah, with another video. I'm also a hip-hop recording artist and all of that good old stuff, and I hope you know where to go find my music. Anyway, let's get into this video. Oh man, there, there is a lot here. Um, you know, as far as my awesome pickups for the week, man, this this is a lot of stuff. I have like one, two, three, four. About five, uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11. I got 11 games here, I believe. But anyway, man, I'm just going to get ready to show you guys my awesome pickups. Oh, yeah, for the week. Oh, yeah, this is this is crazy. Crazy. All right, starting off, uh, one game that I got here is Pillars of Eternity. The complete edition. Oh yeah. I don't know if you guys can see that, but there it is. The complete edition here. Um, I really, really wanted this game and I wanted to get into it, especially when I saw that there was a part two uh out already and things of that nature. Uh th this kind of flew under my radar, but I, I like games like this, and so Again, can't wait to get into it. Can't tell you much about it because I haven't played it, of course. So, but Pillars of Eternity, the complete edition right here. And next, I have about one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, seven, eight, nine, ten, I don't know, almost ten more games here. And these particular games, they fall under the category of, um, or the genre of visual novels. Uh, I went into the game store a couple of times and I asked some of the uh, employees or the people that work there, uh, just like, hey, do you guys have any visual novel games? And they were like looking at me crazy like, what? What is that? Yeah. So they, they were staring at me crazy like they didn't understand nothing I was talking about. So when I uh, pointed out a game, I think there's a new game being released soon um, that's called... Uh, hopefully I don't get it wrong, but is it wrong to pick up girls in a dungeon? Uh, I don't know if you guys have seen the show or whatnot of that, but basically that when I mentioned that game, they were like, oh, JRPGs. And I was like, no, yeah, but no, but JRPGs and visual novels are two different genres in my opinion. But for some reason, when you mention visual novels, people think of JRPGs. I don't know why, but okay. But, you know, the, the, the difference, if if I could break it down for you, is uh, the difference between JRPGs and visual novels is, uh, you know, in JRPGs here, there's a lot of dialogue, and, you know, you're going to do some reading, but you're in the dungeon. You're in dungeons. You're doing, you're going through. You're, you're attacking. You're, you, 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 know, you, you, you know, you get the RPG feel. As uh, far as visual novels, it's more of you're reading a lot. And you're reading a lot and occasionally you have a puzzle or two to do or occasionally you get to make a choice and based on your choices, how the outcome of the game or, or how things will take place. Based on what you choose or say, that's how things will take place in the novel or in the visual novel or in the game. So, but hopefully I didn't confuse you guys. But anyway, let's get to the other games that I have here. All right. First, um, I do actually own a couple of visual novels, uh, which are, um, I think, Norin 9 and Root Letter. So, yeah, I do already have those two plus a few more, but those are the two that stand out. But as far as what I got here for the week, first off, we have Cult of Dama, The Seven Mysteries of Fujisawa. So, yeah, I, I think I pronounced that right. But here is this one. Oh, yeah. So that's the uh, first one I got here. Second is Our World is Ended. So, yeah, this is, um, I, I, I heard this game here is awesome. This one is great. So I wanted to pick it up and, and try it out for myself. And next is Raging Loop for the Nintendo Switch. So I got a couple of these on the Switch. And I think this game actually started out on iOS, if I'm not 
mistaking. So yeah, this, this I think this is gonna be great. This seems like it's like you got some you know scariness or horror type feel to it. Okay. And then next we have Dusk Driver. Am I saying that right? I think that's what it says there. So Dusk Driver, that, that's what I'm gonna keep it at. You guys can correct me if I'm wrong. I can't really read that, but there it is. This is gonna be great too. I, I just can't wait to get into a lot of these because you know especially on the switch because i can take them on the go and i can just read and, and do a puzzle here and there okay and next i got a bunch of packages that need opened so here we go with the first package here Let's see what we got ah! all right this one actually has two games in it all right so all right and so right here we have you know a girl who chants love at the bound of this world yeah that's a lot to say but still in the plastic here brand new here it is right here for the nintendo switch oh yeah can't wait can't wait all right man and next is hakuoki warriors of the shinsugami or warriors of the shinsugumi um this is not actually a visual novel and yeah i went way back on the psp y'all oh yeah this is not actually a visual novel like i said but it's based on one and the one that it's based on is um hakuoki uh demon the fleeting blossom i believe so yeah i can't wait to get into this as well gonna be a great game i mean especially to whip the psp back out and i'm gonna be going crazy Ooh, what, what? what? <coughs> yeah PS psp so yeah can't wait to whip out my psp and see what that bad boy is still all about oh yeah the next package here all right here we go a lot of game i told you i had a lot of games this, this video is probably gonna be like 20 minutes i'll try to break it down all right song of memories oh yeah another visual novel here oh yeah so like i said guys i i got a lot of visual novels going on here and this one was imported actually so but song of memories what are you guys thinking so far? I mean, are you guys into visual novels out there? Or, or these games? Or do you think they're RP or JRPGs? All right. Next package. Next package. Woo! Woo! All right. And we have Signs Gate. All right. Yes. 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 I've been waiting on this. I, I, I've been trying to get this. I, I think I would go into my local game store, I'd see it, and there's one time I left to go get the money to come back and it was gone. So this is a, a good one here. This is a good one if you guys are into these type of games or, or, or if you wanna try to get into these type of games, this is a good one here. Also one that I don't have in this uh, particular stack, I believe is a good one is um, uh, what is Ace Attorney. I think that was on like the DS or 3DS. That, that That's a good one as well. But yeah, Signs Gate here. So I got a lot of them on the Switch, guys. I, I, you know I'm going to be on the go. And I saved this one because I got another one. But I wanted to open this one kind of towards the last because it feels big. It's pretty big. So here we go. All right. Now this is a tall box here. So we have Code Realized Guardian of Rebirth Collectors Edition, guys. Yeah, got me a collector's edition of it here. And so uh, within this collector's edition, of course, you get the pretty box. You know, they always include this box. You get the game, a keychain, uh, an art book, and uh, this is like a 60-page exclusive art book and a soundtrack. Oh, yeah. All right, and lastly, we have one more package to crack open. Oh, yeah. 
All right, and here we have Tokyo Twilight Ghost Hunters. There it is. Oh yeah, check it out. Tokyo Twilight Ghost Hunters. Woo! And yeah, the last game right here on my radar, and the last game that I picked up for my awesome pickups. And I, I can't wait to get into this, not just this, but all of these games. Oh yeah, so remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Share you guys' thoughts on all the games that I picked up for my awesome pickups for the week. Would love to know what you guys think about the visual novels and the um, not so visual novels and the one that really isn't one. Yeah, just random pickups here. And don't forget to hit that bell button so you guys will be notified when I'm doing new videos. Until next time, thank you guys for tuning in to Game Head. Oh, yeah.